today's business spotlight, we're going to learn more about a business called Firestorm Ohio. And joining us today, the CEO, Jerry Greer, and we've got the COO, Dion Essinger. And thanks for joining us, both of you. Thanks for having us. Okay, so who wants to take this question? What is Firestorm Ohio? What do you guys do? Um, so Firestorm Ohio, we're a, a moving company and a clean-out company as well as a, a storage company. Um, so we move people locally and across the country, as well as we do clean-outs for properties, for real estate companies, for landlords along the line. And also we have our own line of portable storage pods, as well as indoor climate-controlled storage. Okay. Uh, first, let's start with the moving part then. Um, will you come in and help box up things or do people box them up and then you guys just get them to the right place? How, how does it work? We actually do both. We have packing services with our own packing supplies where we can come in and pack and then get them moved as well. Or we can just, they can pack and we can just give them the boxes or some customers are packed and they're ready to go and we just come in and move them. All right. I know many times you go through a neighborhood and you see like a bunch of stuff on the curb. When you talk about cleaning up a, a place for um, a landlord or a business, is that what you mean? Like stuff that's left behind by the tenants? Yeah, I think typically we'll get a call from a landlord or a, a real estate company just because someone moved out or they relocated to another state or another city and uh, a bunch of stuff is left behind. Or, you know, unfortunately, sometimes like an eviction, that's when we'll get a call from the landlord saying, hey, I got a bunch of stuff left over, I gotta get this place re-rented. So if you guys could come in and kind of just clean the slate and start over for us, we'll take it from there. So that's where the, the whole clean outside thing has started to fall in. Right, yeah, wow. And you, you mentioned those pods. I, I feel like those are really popular right now for people for storage and things, right? Tell us about that kind of service. Uh, well, we have uh, pods where you can store indoor here with our climate control, or we can take it to your site um, and store it there, or you can store outside here as well. Um, we can help load it. We can help load it and unload it. Sorry. Um, and then they get it, and then we can move it to the next location as well. We relocate. And I think, I think you're right. It started to become very popular because... Um, we're getting calls from the Lima area to Toledo to Indiana wanting the pod. One of the pods that you see is right behind us. So it kind of gives you an idea about what we are. You know, um, I'm, a, I'm a firefighter. That's my full-time job. And we also run these businesses. And uh, the reason that we went with Firestorm is because of the fire background. But uh, as you can see, the axes on the back here that are on our logo um, kind of brought the whole fire department theme to what we do. So that's been kind of exciting. And like you did say, these these uh, portable storage units have become tremendously popular. Yeah, really they have. Okay, so that leads me to wonder, what is your service area? Where, where are you located and like how far out do you go? Well, we go, we go all over Northwest Ohio. And uh, like I said, the, the Lima area has been very popular for us and that's been a tremendous blessing for us. But uh, we've moved people all the way to San Francisco, uh, all the way down to uh, Miami, Florida area, and all the way to Canada. So we've become very popular with starting to move people all over the country. So when they ask us, wh wh where will you go? Well, you tell us where you want to go and we'll get you there. <laughs> I guess so. Well, you mentioned that really firefighters full-time job, but I feel like these businesses can really take a lot of time. Do you, do you see them expanding and maybe retire from firefighting early or something? <laughs> well, I, that, that's me and my wife's hopes that someday we can do that. Uh, my wife is an elementary principal and uh, we're, we're getting near the end of our uh, careers in that world. But uh, we've, we've been blessed because people like Dion here and I have a tremendous staff of like 30 to 40 people right now and doing moves all over and, you know, moving these pods around and doing a lot of the packing and clean outs that we talked about. So I think you wrap yourself around a lot of good people and uh, good things will happen. Wow. It's really been great to learn more about your business. Thanks for joining us today. Thank you so much. All right. First edition Thank continues you. in a moment.